Welcome to my apartment. I'm really excited. I've been wanting to do this video for a long time. So let's get started. So obviously this is what you see when you first walk in. And let's go ahead and get started with the kitchen. So I love how this is an open floor plan and how the ceilings are so high. But there's a problem with that. I'm so short that I can literally only reach the first two shelves. Like there's no way that I can put stuff up there. Short little problems. So over on my refrigerator, I have these really cute magnets about moms and daughters. Every time my mom sees one of these, she has to buy one for me. <laughs> and moving along, just my stove, oven, microwave. And over here, my sink. I love this sink because it is huge, it's deep, it doesn't have that divider, so I just love it. And right above the sink is like my little bar area. I've pretty much had these drinks since I moved in here last year, so I really don't drink, but it's nice to have just in case. And over here, just some wine, my bottle opener, and a cute little sign my mom got me very true nursing is the hardest job you'll ever love and so over here we have this table which came with the place it's like connected to the wall and then it has these two nice drawers that i just throw a bunch of junk in and for my stools i got this from wayfair they match perfectly with my kitchen because they're gray and white. And you guys are probably going to hear me say Wayfair a million times in this video. So the cool thing about this table is also that it has little outlets on the side. And also our outlets, some of them have like the little USB ports, so that's very helpful. Over here is my pantry. And right above my pantry, we have our family portrait, back when times were much simpler. Um, in the left-hand corner is a picture of me, my mom, and my brother. And then on the right side, we have my dad. And the painter was able to paint him into the background because I believe he was overseas in Kuwait or someplace. So that's pretty cool. As far as my pantry, guys, it's pretty empty in here, okay? But don't worry, I'm gonna go grocery shopping as soon as I finish this video. So let's move on to the living room. Over here, I just had this cube shaped bookcase and it's also from Wayfair. I love that it's mirrored. It has mirrors on all sides, so that's pretty cool. On top, I have a graduation gift from when I graduated from nursing school. I think that's pretty cute. And here, another one of those daughter poems that my mom loves to buy. And at the bottom, I just have some photo albums. Over here, my couch is from Rooms to Go. And it is the Calvin Heights collection. And so above my couch, I really wanted to get a big painting, but I couldn't find one that I liked until I saw this. I love this painting, it's so cool. And on the sides, it's framed with gold. I love it. So my coffee table is also mirrored and so is my tray. I just have mirrors like literally all over. And then of course I had to get coasters. They're also trimmed in gold to match my painting and my pictures. Oh, not my pictures, my pillows. <laughs> and so I was initially just gonna get an all white rug but then I saw this one and I thought it was so cool. I don't know if you guys can see on camera, but like it has these gold shimmers on it. It sparkles. So like I just had to get it. And 
And I have become one of those people that are just like, oh no, you can't wear your shoes on my rug. So, I mean, it's white. Like, I try to keep it clean. So, I never thought I'd be that person, but I am. As you can see, I do like to keep things very simple and plain. I am a plain Jane myself, and I'm not afraid to admit it. I love darker and neutral colors, so you can see that I really stuck to the whole white, gray, and gold theme. Also, one of the things that I like about the lights is that when you turn it off, it just slowly dims down. I don't know why, but I just really like that. <laughs> And over here we just have my TV, my TV stand, and just some random decorations. So now let's go outside. This is like one of my favorite parts of my place. So I didn't want to have a lot outside of my balcony, so I just got this really cute swing chair. I love it. So comfortable. And then this is like my favorite part. Out here we have grills, different places to sit down. There's a fireplace right here. And there's even a waterfall. Like sometimes when I'm inside, I think it's raining, but it's simply just the waterfall. It's very peaceful and cute out here. We even have string lights that come on every night. It's super cute. So this is what it looks like at night when the lights are on. And so you can't hear right now because it's still kind of early, but at night it gets really loud out here with like the frogs and crickets. I guess the waterfall just attracts all kinds of and it just sounds like I'm camping in the middle of the woods. At first it was very crazy but now I don't even notice it and it's actually pretty peaceful. Alright so let's go back inside. So now let's go to my bedroom. So this is my room. It's actually kind of small, but mostly because my bed is so big. I got a king size bed. And because I don't have a lot of space, I decided to get a storage bed. So it has like these huge drawers that I can throw extra clothes in. So I love it. And the cool thing about this bed is I'm only 5'2", so I can literally do a full 360 in this bed and not even hang off of it. So over here is just my guitar and unfortunately no I do not know how to play it so someone please teach me. And then I have my nightstand. Just outside that same gorgeous view. And on this side we have my vanity mirror. I love this thing. So at the very top, I have a cute little sign that says blessed because I believe I am very blessed. My mirror is from Impressions Vanity, of course. One of my favorite parts about this mirror is that it is silent. So when you turn it on, it doesn't make that loud buzzing noise. And then also you can brighten and dim the light. And then my table is actually a writing desk. It's also from Wayfair, but I saw in the reviews that a lot of people were using it as a vanity table, and I thought that was a great idea. So it just has this one little drawer, which is perfect because I really don't wear a lot of makeup because I don't know how to put it on. <laughs> I'm still learning. And then I just have my brushes, lipsticks, nail polish on top, and then, of course, <laughs> Another little poem about daughters because my mom is obsessed. <laughs> she loves me and I love her. And then my stool is also mirrored and it's also from Wayfair. Right next to it we have a closet. This is basically where I just keep my towels, sheets, blankets, random things like that. 
you know over here is my closet it's kind of junky but you know got to work with what I have and so my closet came with like this built-in cubby so I just put all my shoes in there I wish I could get rid of my boxes but I just have way too many shoes and moving along we have my bathroom I really like this bathroom right now. It has this huge mirror, two sinks, and I have this cute little sign, thankful, grateful, blessed, all things that I am. And here is my shower, also a huge garden tub. I love how big it is. And then my shower head is really cool because it comes down, like you can pull it down and then rinse off all over. I love it. And then moving along right in here, we just have my washer and dryer. Nothing all that special in here. And then over here, oh my goodness, we have my degree from Duke University. I've mentioned that I went to Duke before, so if you didn't believe me, here's my proof. <laughs> I majored in biology and graduated in 2016. And then we have my second degree over here from nursing school. So I promise I'm not on YouTube just, you know, giving advice about nursing. I actually am a nurse, Medical University of South Carolina. All right guys, and we have come full circle. So the only other things over here are my little closet. That's just where I keep my broom, trash can, vacuum. And then this is pretty cool too on my door. So we don't have like a regular people. I didn't know what this was when I first moved here, but it's like a webcam and you can see who's out there. And if you press it again, it zooms in. Sorry if you probably can't see it that well. But I really like it here and I don't even get to use this thing that often because you can't even get into my building without a key. So whenever I do have visitors, they have to let me know that they're outside and then I go down and go get them. So that is basically my apartment in a nutshell. I love it here. It's my first apartment on my own. So I think I did pretty well. Very tall ceilings. Like, I just love it here and I want to show it off. So I hope you all enjoyed my apartment tour. And I will catch you guys in the next video. As I always say, I hope you all have a lovely day.